Uh, welcome back to Everyday Race. This is going to be a part three video of me testing this Mo Glide heavy duty friction reducer. Now, let me get back to the past. In a part one video, I've used this Castrol non synthetic. I applied it to engine bearings of my non running 2.3 uh, liter uh, Ford engine. And then I've added this stuff to the soil and then I reapplied to the bearings again and measured coefficient of friction now the results came out pretty interesting so I proceeded to part two where I actually added the stuff to my engine now on in, in the part two video I've measured coolant temperature of the engine before and after by using this torque app and this uh, OBD2 diagnostic interface and then I use my infrared temperature gun to measure temperature of the oil pan before and after to see if uh, there was any difference you know less friction usually means reduction in temperature and once again the results were uh, pretty surprising and now uh, you can watch the, that video right over there if you want so there was only one thing left to do is do a part three video and see if there was any uh difference in miles per gallon in fuel consumption of the truck with regular oil and treated oil so what i did is i took the data before at 89.81 mi uh, miles the truck was averaging 31.4 miles to the gallon with just a non-synthetic 10w30 gas oil after that I drove 100, 157 more miles, and the temperature was the same, I had the same route, pretty close to the same uh, conditions, and my miles per gallon went up to 32.7, which is a gain of 1.3 miles to the gallon. Now, I prefer to put another four or 500 miles, unfortunately, the temperature and the weather condition changed the temperature and dropped and uh, this truck gets less miles per gallon in cooler temperatures due to due to the air being more dense meaning it has more oxygen in it so i had to stop collect data only for 157 miles and uh show it to you like once again let me remind you I bought this stuff on eBay for $44.99, it's 16 ounce. I uh, use my own money. I am not sponsored by this company. I have nothing to lose and I have nothing to gain except for better fuel consumption, maybe more power. Now, one thing I forgot to mention is uh, some of the videos that I've seen with this stuff, they said that their engine started to run smoother now my engine vibrates about the same way i i did not notice any reduction in engine vibrations the only thing i've noticed is i had to put less fuel in the truck to get the same miles so uh, that's going to be it for this part three video i'm fixing to put this stuff in just about everywhere in my truck you're gonna have to come back and see what it does and uh once again thank you for watching and have a good day